I want to take a minute and welcome you to the inside of the springboard. Now, before we get started, there's two things that I want you to do. One, I want to make sure that you've downloaded and you've read through the springboard service document that will be provided beneath this video so you can better understand more about the springboard and how it functions. Please understand that no tutorial is going to replace this document. You really want to read through it and understand everything before you get started. After you've done that, click and download the summary of product offering so you can better understand all of the products that we offer inside of Infinii so that you can move forward and make sure that you're on the right levels and understand what you are getting at every level inside of Infinii. So do that right now. Download those two docs. Make sure you read and understand all of them and do not proceed until you do understand both of those documents. Having said that, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and purchase an item on Springboard so I can show you what to expect and make sure you're off to the right start with Springboard. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a look at what Springboard products are available right now. Please keep in mind, please understand that the items that are on here may change minutes after you're on the page, hours, Tomorrow there might be different products here. In fact, we update this quite regularly. And in a lot of cases, in a matter of minutes from when you're first on here, okay? So again, just letting you know to keep refreshing this page or come back later when you're, it's time for you to go ahead and make a purchase. All right, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna actually go ahead and purchase this Dash right here. All right, this particular product is retailing for $149.99. Does that mean you cannot find it cheaper out there on the internet? No, that is not what that means. That doesn't mean that. That means that this is the typical retail price that we find. The total fees involved are $27.45. Keep in mind that a lot of these fees are actually generated from Amazon and not from us. So please keep in mind, uh, keep that in mind and go ahead and review those documents again for further details on that. The expected profit per unit is $25.54. This does not guarantee that that is going to be the profit. In fact, there is no guarantee that this item is even going to sell, but this is the expected profit based on the information that we have at the time of listing it. You'll also see a management fee and you'll see MOQ. Again, that does not mean that we will only have 75. This might fill up and then a whole new 75 might pop on one might pop on, 10 might pop on to the springboard. So keep that in mind that items can come on and pop on and off of the springboard at any given time. The cost per unit is $97 or 97 credits. So if I go to purchase this, I would be spending $97 to go ahead and acquire this particular item. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna acquire this. So I'm gonna click on buy this product and what you'll see here when you hit this page on your purchase dashboard is that there are units remaining. That means we have units on this particular springboard. There's 37 of them. The maximum allowed units, 30. That's because of my level. And what this is telling me right here is that I do not have enough credits to buy this product, so please purchase credits. Currently in this account, I have 80 credits available and the unit price is 97. So I need to go get some credits. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get some credits. So I'm gonna click on purchase credits and you'll see an order form here and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to select how many credits I want. I'm actually gonna get 75 because I plan on using them. I'm going to scroll down and verify my billing address and make any changes that I need to. I'm gonna select my card type and I'm going to fill out this information. Once I've filled out all my information, I'm gonna click purchase. And if it was successful, like you can see that it was, I can go on back into the springboard and finish my purchase. So now that I have my credits, I'm gonna go ahead and click on buy this product again. And we'll see now that the screen has changed and I can purchase more credits. So my current available balance is 155 credits. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna purchase this and I'm gonna purchase one of them. And I have a couple options here. Now I can have the product shipped directly to me. And if I do that, if I want to do that, then I have to be a, a licensed reseller of this product, provide my information, my state, and my license number. I am not a licensed reseller of this product. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and sh have it shipped and managed for me to sell this item. So I'm gonna click on that. And once I do, you're gonna see another button pop down. Clicking on this means that Infinii is gonna go ahead and manage the acquisition 
and the sale of this item on my behalf. And you'll see a cost involved with that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set my price that I want to sell it at. You can indeed set your price of what you want to sell it at. Notice that there's a minimum retail price required. That is because if you go below this amount, we then we have determined and we do not believe that you'll be profitable with it. Okay, so I want to go above that minimum. I'm actually going to set it right at the minimum so that I can have a better chance of selling that. And to be honest, if you want to check on this, you can go ahead and research this particular product, see what it's selling out there. And if you want to raise the price, you can raise the price. That is all within your control. So I see this, I see that the cost is 97.35. My balance after purchase is 58.30. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click submit. Now you'll see that my product has been reserved for me. That's it, that's all I had to do. Um, I've successfully reserved that item for purchase and it will be purchased on my behalf and I will be able to view reports of that. So that's about it on the springboard. That's how you go ahead, get credits, get into the springboard and acquire the products, purchase the products. Again, please do me a favor and you'll see this, this page refreshed. Uh, giving me some other options. Please do me a favor and make sure, make sure that you read and understand both of the documents beneath this video because again, no tutorial can take the place of actually reading the documents that are set out by Infinia. Okay, thank you very much and I, I wish you massive success with your springboard.